What's going on, beautiful people? It's your boy Terrence Gibson here about to go through another video on how to sign someone up for Manifest. What you can do is you study this form yourself after you become a manifester and you can give it to your new manifestors when they come in so that they can look at it while you're looking at it and then everybody can have the same information and then they can join together. But the company sends out this information and the emails, but just most people won't read them. So this is just helping you help them so they can help someone else to get uh, signed up. So let's jump right into it. Um, helping somebody to sign up to manifest, send them whatever video or whatever you use to entice them, depending on if you just use a conversation. I mean, whatever you use, however you got them in. For me, I send them my videos. I'm a YouTuber. So I have a ton of videos, manifest deep, a um, lot of views on all my videos. Uh, and I had another video right here that's the same video that I'm just redoing, just redoing and updating. Um, they made things easier since I did this video because I, when I joined at Manifest, if I joined LCM, I joined right when we first moved. Um, actually, I kind of joined LCM FX while they were talking about, and they flew, they flashed the link. I was already in it because, um, you know, you don't wait for a whole crowd of people to do something at the same time. You jump in as soon as you can. Um, so I jumped into the LCM as soon as uh, Josh posted the link and I was rolling. So I had a, a easy transformation and, and from LQDFX to LCMFX, and it was, it was pretty easy. So that's my other video. This is the new video. Both of them will be just as good. So let's go and keep on rolling. Um, all right, give them your paid to live link or your manifest ID. So if you're in paid to live, let's go back and show you that again. That's our um, invitement tool. We, don't, <laughs> we try not to use the word recruit because we're not really recruiting. I mean, unless we're recruiting you to a better uh, future, because MLM then messed up so many words that recruit don't really mean a bad thing. It's just the fact that I'm telling you about something, it, it fills your heart that you want it, and then you join me. And that's really what it is. And that's what the word means. So we're inviting you, this is our invitement tool, <laughs> inviting you to let your money start working for, for you instead of you working for your money. Or if you have this system, you'll give them your link and then it'll run them through, follow up, email, text messages, however it files up, it's going to follow up for you and uh, do an excellent job at it. Or you give them your manifest ID link. If you got some idea, if you got somebody want to just sign up right now, just give them your link. You don't even have to give them the page. If you could just go ahead and give them your straight up link, get them signed up. That's the best thing to do. So that way you'll need them going through all that and then it's a whole nother class and they're already ready to go. This is for people who, you know, they on the fence. They don't know if they want to do it or don't want to do it. That's how you do it. So you come in, you manifest, you log in, go to my account and go to the affiliate area and that'll pop up. And then you just grab your link. Make sure you highlight it correctly and send it to them. Make sure you highlight it correctly and send it to them. And back here in this office also, you'll let them know um, when you get them signed up after they come up, because you're supposed to walk them through the back office to get them to sign up. And we'll talk about that in a second. But this is also where they can find their statistics, their graphs, referrals, uh, payouts, visits, creatives, settings, sub affiliates. They can find all that stuff back here. And the DTA form they're going to need later on, they can find it right here. So since I'm a CEO, I have a CT CEO DTA form. And if they join at a lower level, they'll, their form will be right there in the same spot also. It just won't, you know, of course, be the CEO form. All right, back to the sheet. All right, walk them through the Manifest website on how to join and make sure they pick the correct package. Make sure they pick, get their affiliate link from them and after they join as confirmation or check your back office to see them. All right, so like I just went over, um, this is where you'll check. You'll check on your sub-affiliates or your referrals. Pe people's information pop up, so I'm not going to click on them, um, but their information will pop up when you see these. So it's, it's got to be in referrals to show you that they paid and it'll be a sub-affiliate just showing you your... Um, your chain of people. So just make sure you look back here and you can see them. If you don't see it, just ask them to send you their confirmation, um, their payment confirmation, and they'll send it to you also. Because people are so hype and so ready to get their money in the box, they're going to send you whatever you need. <laughs> they're going to send you whatever you need. So when I say walk them through the back office, I wanted to show you which where you need to look to see if you see them after, before you, uh, after you walk them through the back office and when they sign up. So right here, so, since, since I'm already in my account, it's not going to, let's just make sure before I say it, yep, it's not going to show you that these are available, which they are, and I don't really want that to be on my video, so what I'm going to do is come here, I'm going to log out, 
once you're logged in, you don't see the prices. So you got to log out. Then you come down to the bottom and they show available. See, so now they can come in and buy the package. They can come in and um, fill out everything they need to fill out on what they buy and just break down the packages to them in the beginning. If they want to do monthly, just the monthly prices. Right now, these are the prices to April uh, April 15th. So it says March Madness sale, but we just had a meeting. It was it was extended to April 15th and everybody voted yes. Nobody voted no, because we want our people to come in. Of course, we take a cut from our affiliate fee by people coming in this price, but it doesn't matter. That don't even matter. As long as I know it's another family that's taken care of, I'm good. I'm good. I am good. Think about it. I am good. And you really don't lose nothing anyway, because for these prices, you'll get two for the price of one, maybe three for the for the price of one. I mean, it's just how it is, it's just how it works. And that's how Manifest does business. So, and also let them know you can't make them a millionaire overnight. Educate your people. This is not a get rich quick. This is a get rich in time process. This is the tool that's gonna to get them rich. They just have to follow the process, follow the process, put money in their body as they can. Let the bots compound, the eighth wonder of the world, compound it, let it compound. We have in the ninth wonder of the world with digital income, which we have too, because your affiliate fees that you'll get from your first level and your second level are residual. So they come every month. That what residual income means you get it every month. You have residual bills. Why not have residual income? Um, so just make sure your people know what they're getting into and know that in the, the packages, because some people might have a little bit more money than they're telling you to the side. And you understand that CEO, if they buy a CEO for the month and they have $5,000 that they're ready to invest, they might want to get it for the year. Now you can invest $2,000 and pay $3,000, but they'll make more money over time. So it's better just to go ahead and get that for the year because if not, you're going to spend $6,000 that year on that, which is, I mean, it's still a steal, <laughs> but you're going to spend $6,000 that year on that and instead of getting it for $3,000. Could have got it for $3,000, but they're going to spend $6,000. So let them know. Um, that's the yearly fees, the yearly fee on royalty. So it's a saving on each one. So if you pay the yearly fee, you're going to spend less money than you normally would. And right now, while we got this sale, obviously you can see these yearly fees are cheaper than they would ever be. So in the CEO bot and the royalty bot, you get three bots. The difference between the CEO and the royalty and the platinum is they have a 25% performance fee. You see it written here at the bottom. Most people won't read it. You got to point it out to them. And the CEO has no performance fee. No performance fee and VIP to everything. So just let them know the difference between what they join. So you got to walk them through the back office. They might have said, yeah, I'm coming in on the platinum. And then when they come back and look at royalty, they're like, oh. Or they come back and look at CEO, be like, oh, I got a few more dollars. I'm coming in there. I've, I've had it happen over and over again. And you're not trying to stress them to buy something they can't afford. You're just showing them their options because you want them to win, 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 win. You know what I'm saying? And if you, the better one they get from the beginning, they start winning from the beginning. Then you feel better too. Like all my CEOs, matter of fact, I had CEOs before I became a CEO. That's what made me become a CEO, talking to my CEOs. And I was like, uh, yeah, I need to go ahead and make that jump. And I made that jump. <laughs> Jesus name. All right. Um, so, yeah, when you walk them through your back office, get them, let them pick their package they're going to pick. And then when they pick up the package, they click on buy a package and then it'll be a form and they just fill it out. Um, let them also know that they use PayPal, Cash App, anything like that, that with them high security um, it's going to block it on the first one. So then they got to call them and then they'll let it go through. And it just happens all the time. Every time you stripe, that's just what happens. That's just how it works. And that's just, that it is what it is. But you got somewhere like Bank of America. Matter of fact, hold on, I had to, yeah, to call my Bank of America too. So yeah, anybody with a high security bank account, they're going to call. They're going to, you're going to, they're going to uh, say no. Don't, don't freak out. Call your bank, let them know that was you. Like Bank of America, they'll send me a text. And I'll just go to the text and I'm like, yeah, that was me. And I'm mean, going to say, yeah, that was me. but you know how it works. <laughs> and then next time I go ahead and pay for it, it'll go through. And that's how it works. All right. But you keep your people informed. Keep them up to date. Don't just lead them into business. We're just not MLM. We're not just putting people in and then forgetting about them. Lead them all the way through. 
the process, put them in all the groups so they can get all the information and teach them to get the information on their own. If not, you're going to be holding hands the whole time. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with holding hands. I'm just saying you don't need them to be taking baby steps or drinking milk when they should be eating meat. We need, to, we need everybody to be eating meat because when they're eating meat, they can go tell other people and then everything starts to grow. Everything starts to grow. All right, you're walking through the website. We're on number four now. Now it's time for LCMFX. They should have received the Manifest FX LCM signup link and one of their welcome emails. They have to use the link to get connected to the bots. So in their emails, once they sign up, they paid, they're going to get like four emails. And then the third or fourth email is going to come with the link, the Manifest link. And when they log in, this is the form they're going to see. When they click on the link, they're going to come to this form. And this form right here, and I'm moving it fast as I got my information on. Um, when it comes to the uh, to the form, it's going to then they'll come through and they'll uh, fill it out. And it's the bottom, like this information out here is actually my information. This is what I put when I first filled out. So a lot of people are like, what are, what is my investment? Just what what is my revenue source? Um, how much do I plan to invest? I just put a thousand because that's what I plan on putting in the box at the time. So I just put that there. Of course, I'm going to put more. Uh, later on in life, they just want to get to get to fill you out for what you're going to do. And my position was CEO. And I put this in when I joined as a platinum. So now I'm a CEO. <laughs> you know, I mean, speak life on yourself. You know what I'm saying? Gibson Brands. That's my last name of Brands. That's that's who employs me. Me. You know what I'm saying? I work for Jesus, of course, you know. But anyway, um, length of employment for a month. So I was only I was only um, been full time for four months. Not like I wanted to be at the time, but, you know, God knows how to work things out. So now it's a, it's a total blessing. All right. So they'll fill this form out and they come down, put the ID. You got to upload a copy of your driver's license, take a picture of it, email it to yourself, text it to your email. Whichever way you do it, you do it. And the proof of address, either an e-bill or um, take a picture of a bill and upload it the same way. And then come there and click next. And they should, everything should go through. And they should send you a, another email well, by the time you finish getting emails from this thing, it's going to be about eight emails just signing up for just your first, uh, your wallet and your trading account. That ain't even that ain't for the people that start off as CEO and it's going to have uh, two trading, three trading accounts or royalty that's going to have three trading accounts. All right, let's go back to the sheet. All right, so that was four. All right, they need to fill out the form, provide ID, e-bill, and take a picture and upload it, send them this video to help them walk through the process. Um, so pretty much what it's going to do in the video, I'm going to show you a little bit on how it goes through when you're here. So a lot of people get confused. So when you come here, you're not going to have this. This is not going to be there. That's going to come after. Um, so first thing you want to do is you're going to come here. The MT4 accounts. When you come to your first first time coming to MT4 accounts, it will not look like this. It's going to have like two of these things here, and it's going to say Get Wallet. It's only going to have three things on here. It's going to say Get Wallet. You click Get Wallet, and then you fill out the information. On that information, you're going to have to put a password. You can use your same password you use for uh, to log into LCMFX. But when you get to your phone password, you have to make that something totally different. Make it something totally make it crazy. Make it just crazy as you can, because that's that password is the only password people can use to withdraw or deposit into your account. That's your most important pass. I can get into this part of your account and I can't do nothing. But when I go to go do a withdrawal, I got to have that phone password. So they can be in here reading your stuff and all this. Now they can't mess with nothing. They can't do nothing or nothing with nothing around nothing <laughs> without that password. So. You come to MT4 accounts. First thing you're going to do is you come in here, go here, and then you'll go, you'll click on get wallet. And once you fill out that information, you click um, at the bottom, you're going to say get code or process or confirm. It's going to send you an email. You go to your email, you confirm it at the email. If it say get code, you get the code or it'll show up here on the screen when you come back and you'll just click whatever you have to click. And then when you come back, you go to my accounts, MT4 accounts an account list and both of your accounts will be there. Both of your accounts will be there. So these are just what you do. MT4 accounts, you go here, get wallet. Do everything you need to do to get the wallet. Go to the email, conf confirm what you need to confirm. And then you come back here and you come back to MT4 accounts and click on account list. 
and your accounts will show up and your accounts will show up and nobody can't do nothing with my information that's in my account but i just don't want to show it on a video i mean i have definitely have money in my accounts i have all the other stuff i just don't want to show uh stuff in my video because if they don't have my password they can't get into my account anyway and they don't have my other password even if you get into this you can't get into my other thing because my other password is different than the other password and that's what you have to have you got to have that added security because to tell you the truth you can have an lcmfx password then you can have the second password as another password for your accounts and then the phone password can be another password so you get three three passwords protecting your stuff and that's i think that's the best thing to do too i just did it the other two ways because i know you're not going to get my phone password um so that's what you do and then you come back and you check your account list and it shows you what you have that shows you what you have so and that's what you would do so if you're coming in in the beginning and you're ceo or royalty you have three bots you get three accounts after you did that and you came to account list you see your wallet and your trading account now you have to come back up here and apply for another account and you do that two more times do everything it needs you to do. Matter of fact, we can click on that. You fill it out. You come here, account type. It's going to be trading, USD. If your money's in euro, ask them. All you got to do is send in a support ticket, help desk, and ask them to turn all your money into uh, USD if you need to be in USD. But this is where I was talking about the passwords. Choose a password. This, doesn't, this could be your LCMFX password or it could be a whole new password. And then your phone password, this is the most important password. Most important password. Let me say it one more time. Most important password. If you figure God got the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost, three, I'm gonna say it three times. Most, well, I'll say it one more time for you, for, for us, put us on the end. Most important password. You have to make this something totally different or something totally crazy. That way nobody can never touch your account. And then you keep your leverage at 500. It's the best one it has, which is excellent. Uh, I just say keep it at 500 and turn this video. And then you click register. And then it probably send you an email. It's going to tell you what it's going to do. It's always going to tell you what it's going to do. Then you confirm it. Then you come back and you do it the same thing over again for your second account. And then when you go back to your account list, you'll see more than one account. You'll see more than one account. Um, when you click on account list, you'll see three, three or four accounts. You'll, you'll have four accounts. One just going to be a wallet and the other three will be your trading accounts. And every time you deposit, your money will go to your wallet. And every time you withdraw, you have to change your money back from your account to your wallet to withdraw. And now we're about to go through the deposit process. So then you made your accounts. You got your three accounts or your one account and you have your wallet. That's what you have. That's all that you need. And if you mess anything up, you can come over here and change your password, change your phone password. Change these passwords. Make sure you log out after you do them so that they can um, take effect. Because if you don't log out, you won't get your new password. All right. So what you do when you come to deposit, you come to make a deposit. And I can show you this too. Come to make a deposit. So remember, this is going to go to your wallet. So no matter how many accounts you got, if you're going to, if you want to, if you have a CEO bot or a royalty bot and say you have $10,000 and you want to do the 80-10-10, that's my rule. 80 in the big in the biggest account that that's the money you plan on using you know monthly if you want to use it monthly and then you have two accounts with a uh, thousand and a thousand and you just sit them in there and forget about them. one to two years you'll be a multi multi-millionaire in no time and think about where else can you go and become a multi multi-millionaire in two years uh anyway so you come to deposit make a deposit pick which way you want to do if you want to do a wire transfer if you do a wire transfer you click on wire and you go through the process. And at the end, when you click on send notification, you'll pick your currency, uh, USD. You'll pick your, that's your wallet. That's my wallet account. Um, Cause my money's in my box. So there's nothing in the wallet. And then you'll pick an amount, any amount. It doesn't matter here, put anything, put whatever you want to put, right? And then you click send notification. So when you do a wire, it's going to send you a PDF for your Zelle. It's going to have all the information you need for Zelle or Wire, but it's going to be on the same thing. So if you want to do Zelle, you go in your back office at your bank, you set up, you set them up as a um, as a recipient so that you can set them up for email because Zelle is free for the email, but they charge 2%. So the more money you send it, it's best to use Wire. 
Because if you send a bunch of cryptocurrency and you got to keep transferring your money to cryptocurrency and then from crypto, you got to send it in crypto from here to somewhere else, you're going to get charged all those different fees. You're going to get charged. So it is what it is. Use the 2% for the wire transfer. And it, and it takes like one to two hours. That, that's been my testimony. So I don't know. And then also when I got to be about one hour, um, I emailed them. As soon as I emailed them, the money was in. The second time I emailed them and came back and the money was in already. And I was like, oh, no. I mean, they was putting the money in while I was sending an email. So just let them do their job. They're, they're excellent. They're excellent. That's why we have just a million dollar broker. This ain't no cheapy El Cheapo broker. Million dollar broker. All right, so you got your deposits. This is what you do to make your deposits. Right? Right. Okay, so that's wire transfer. So LCM crypto is going to be a little different. So you go, you pick crypto, you do BC, BTC to BTC. I only would do BTC to BTC because if you do ETH or LTC, you got to send, you got, it's different than BTC. BTC, BTC, you're going to get a wallet for it. These two, you're going to send them. Then you got to send a message to them, let them know you sent it. It's just too much for me. BTC, BTC, I got a wallet that I can go ahead and check. And then you, you do the same account number. It's going to come in here. You put the amount that you're sending. Just make up an amount. And then when you come down here, you click send notification. It'll be something right here you click on, and it'll make you a, a BTC wallet. And I'm about to show you that right now because I can show you the BTC wallet. Um, the Zelle information... I uh, won't show because it has my, um, let me see, I still have it still here, no, I don't have it on there, it has my um, account numbers and stuff on it, so, which is going to be personalized to you, but it's going to be Zelle, it's going to be everything you need to sign up for Zelle, for this one now, all I got to do is come here, after that is done, and I can get my crypto out, and you can't withdraw from this, this is for me to add money to, so, I don't mind showing it. Now, if you want to send me some money, go ahead. That's my wallet right there. I take donations. <laughs> anyway, and that's how you do it. That's how you do it. So when you go to put the money in, you keep coming here. If you're doing BTC, you'll keep coming to check BTC deposit. So if you put BTC, I'll click on that too. Um, you can just keep coming to check BTC deposit. And you'll find the amount that comes in, when it came in, um, and then right here, it's going to say no, and it's going to say submit. You click on the link. Whatever this link says right here, you click on it. There's going to be another link going to pop up here. You click on that too. And then the money is going to leave your wallet. I mean, leave this, this portal right here and go straight to your wallet. It's going to go straight to your wallet. So remember, after you, after you send the BTC, whichever way you send it, Cash App, Coinbase, um, however you send your, your uh, BTC, you send it straight there. Straight to here, to that uh, crypto wallet, and you come back to deposit and you keep checking it. Keep checking. And as soon as it comes, it'll be a no here and a link here. And what you can do too also, when you send the money to the wallet, what you do is, let me see, I'm just going to put it on here right now for you, make it part of this video, blockchain.com. So now Cash App has a thing on your phone where you can click it. And you can it, you can count the confirmations to show you that your money is coming. So here, I've seen the money come between three and six confirmations. It's supposed to be six. So if you don't see it at three, wait for six. But I've seen it come between three and six confirmations. So you come here. What you do is you'll take you'll take a uh, no not there not that that's the sign up for. I'm gonna get rid of that so I can stop clicking on it. Um, you come here, you take your wallet, the wallet number that you just uh, did, you'll take this, you copy it, you go to blockchain.com, it's just that easy, blockchain.com, and you put it in there, and it's going to let you know, see right now I have no results because there's no money seen, but you're going to see results because once you initiate it in Cash App, I'll let you know it's been initiated. Whatever you're doing and how you send is going to let you know your money has been uploaded to the blockchain. So that means it's in route to you and you start count counting your um, counting your uh, confirmations. Okay, so this, this one is two transactions, two different transactions. And right here, your confirmations will start adding up. Right here. And you'll be able to add your confirmation. You can come up here looking. 
Transactions is your transaction, but your confirmations is what you're looking for. It's going to be right here, somewhere in this area. And once it hits six, it disappears. So you know you get six confirmations. And you just watch it, just watch it, watch it. Now, you may be able to take a picture of this with your phone and have it on your phone and be watching it from there too. I haven't done it, but just for you to check it out and see um, if that's how it works, that's how it works. But if they ask you to pay for something or donate something, no, don't do anything like that. Don't do anything like that. Um, but that's all that's there for. And I just wanted to bring you over here to see it because I, I love telling people everything. Because the more I tell you, the less you, you got to ask me. And I love it like that. Right? Right. All right. So you check in BTC, your BTC come in. If you do Zelle, it's just going to go straight to your wallet. So your money is just going to go straight to your wallet when you do Zelle. And then you view your deposit list. It'll show you um, your different money that came in um, and how it was completed when your money came in as you deposit into your account. And it all comes into your wallet account right here. Um, yeah. So, so it says completed, completed, submitted, submitted. Um, these were completed. So, okay. well, yeah, that's right. It wasn't a wire transfer. I think these were. Um, no, these are ones I set up for to get my Zelle information. Then I sent it. Uh, that's what that was. So that's how you set up. You get your Zelle information, and then you, you send your money. And like I said, Zelle is free, but LCM will charge you to uh, charge you 2% once the money hits the bank. So we'll hit your account here on LCM FX. All right, so that's how you check it. So to check your Zelle money, you come to account list and just check it. After hit about three to six confirmation, the money's going to be there. They're they're very quick. Um, I'm putting it in there, and if it's like an hour or something later after that, just send them a quick support ticket. They'll they'll put the money. It it's there. there it's there, and I mean, it might be a lot of people just joining at the same time. You know, it's humans over there. They're not robots, so. It's still got to work things out to get your money right. So patience is definitely a virtue in business. Patience, patience, patience. Got to have patience. All right. And if you want to ever make a withdrawal, you just come here and you make a withdrawal. I have not plan on doing any withdrawals anytime soon. So um, that'll be another video for another time. So once your money comes, you'll come here to internal transfer, right? So you'll go from wallet. Right. So whatever's in your wallet, which would be your wallet account, you can transfer it to your other accounts. OK, well, some of my information there. But anyway, they can't get in none of this. Um, you can take it from your wallet and you can put it in your accounts. You got to go from from wallet and then you come down here and you start filling out your information. And in your wallet, whatever's in your wallet that's right here will show up right here and right here. And then you just take that number from right here. Now, if you got three accounts, take only what you want to put in that account. So that means you got to come back. You got to remember these numbers. And then you'll have to do them one at a time. Because when you come here, you're going to get your wallet. But when you come down here, you're going to get one of these three accounts. So you got to make sure you're putting the right money in the right account. And then remember what account you put the money in. So when you connect the box at the end, you connect the box to the right account. You know what I'm saying? That way you'll be straight. Um, then you put the amount of here. There's going to be a number, amount, uh, whatever you want to put, uh, 900, whatever. And then your phone password. So obviously that's not actually it. So you got to take that out and then put your phone password in. That's just something that fills out from somewhere else. But and it doesn't really matter. But just remember that ain't it. So make sure you know your phone password. You click get code and it's going to send an email. And then this is when you click the email, it's going to either produce a code here, it's going to give you a code on the email, and you bring it back and you paste it in the block. Now, lately, I've been seeing it in the block, so you don't even have to go through all that. But that's what it's going to do. And then you go ahead and you click it, and then your money is internally transferred from your wallet to your accounts, from your wallet to your accounts. Um, the only best thing you can see from here is that my stuff is profitable. <laughs> uh, let's just keep on going. So that's your internal from your wallet. And if you want to do two wallet, that's going to be when you withdraw. So if you want to withdraw, to make a withdrawal, you got to go two wallets. So you got to go backwards. You'll be taking money out your accounts and sending them to your wallet. You'll take them from out your accounts and sending them to your wallet. 
and you could do an internal transfer. Like say, say if you have all three bots and you like the way one bot is working better than the other bot, you can take some money out of the one account, put it in the other account, or take some money out of this account, put it in that account, or split them down the middle, see what you want to do. But like I told you, like the 80, 20, 20 rule, I'm going to put more in the bigger bot than the bot. And then the other ones, I'm going to let them just, just forget about them. Like they not, they don't even exist until it tells millions of dollars inside of there. Um, yeah. So, so you do two wallet, which is up now, it will be, it'll be all the accounts that pop up here. Let me see. Your accounts will show up here. And then you'll go ahead and go, then whatever you, whatever account you pick, the amount of money will be here. And then you'll pick your wallet because it's going to go from the account to the wallet. And then you'll put the price in there, whatever you know. You're putting another 2000 9000 And then you'll race that and put your phone password in and then hit get code. And then it'll go to your email again. You're going to have a lot of email from this. A lot of emails from this. All right. All right. Then you go back to your email and then you can go ahead and transfer it. All right, let's get back to the sheet. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a nice size process, but it gets everybody rolling. Everybody have everything that they need um, and everybody's good. So CEO royalty, okay, we went over that. Make one wallet, three accounts. CEO will have a separate DTA form. Like I showed you in the back of Manifest, you have a, your, where, your manif where your DTA form is. That's where you get it from. And um, and you get it out your back office. If they upgrade the CEO, if somebody upgrades the CEO, they got to go through their own back office and their pay. And then once they pay, it'll be a little process. And you can send them as a CEO, send them the uh, DTA form so they can start changing their bots over and help your people out. That's what your job is to help people out. Help your people out. All right. Make them aware of the eight emails they will get while signing up. And to make sure their phone password is different than all the other passwords. We went over that. Your phone password has to be different than all the other passwords. So when, I, when you come to the point, you got to get the DTA form and you got to connect it to your bot. And that's what that other thing I was talking about. When you go to the DTA form, and I'm not going to click on it because it has a link, um, my DTA form, but you'll have your DTA form at the top. Your, your first thing that you put in there is going to be your account number. You have to remember the account number that you want connected to the bot. Your account number, then your name, and then the bot that you need. So if you're CEO, you'll have a CEO DTA form. And that's the form that you would use. So it's going to be your account number. Remember your account number. So whichever account, you have three accounts, make sure you know the account number you want to be connected to that bot. And, and you got to have it right. Um, it's not going to be no... If you mess it up, that you just doom. No, they can go back and fix it. But you know, you want yourself to be right. You know what I'm saying? Just do it right the first time. So, if your account, if you got account and the number, the account number is one, two, and three, and you want three to be the CEO bot, you got to go ahead and take three, put three in the account, put your name, and then put CEO. And that's all you got to put. And then you go down and sign it. And then it's going to send you an email. You confirm, confirm, confirm it on an email. And then two, if you want that to be the royal bot. Royalty bot, you put two in the account number, you'll put your name, then you'll put royalty in the next line. And then after that, when you go to the bottom, you'll sign it and you go, your email will come, you confirm the email, and then your DTA form is sent. And if one, if count one want to be the platinum bot, of course, you'll put one, your name, you type your name out, platinum, right there in that line, and then sign it at the bottom, and then you're good. And then the email will come, confirm the email and LCM has it. Most of the time, they will connect your bot before they tell you. So they might got somebody confirming all the bots and then somebody going behind them and sending an email because they confirm they, they connect those bots pretty fast, pretty fast. Uh, I'm just going to say pretty fast. I'm not going to give you a time limit, but they are good. They are good. They're good. But your bot will be connected. Just make sure you connect your bot to the right account with the one with the money you want, you want in there. So... <clears throat> So that should cover the DTA form part. All right. And then that will add to, to the email. So by this point, you probably got 14, 15 emails. <laughs> but, hey, it's letting you know how secure it is. That's how secure it is. All right. Now, once your person has their boss's DTA forms connected, now it's time to invite them to the Facebook groups. 
So now you bring them to the Facebook group. So you got the customer group. You introduce them with a picture and encouragement. So you go to the Facebook customer group and you introduce them with a picture or encouragement. You bring them to the group. In fact, I should have probably had this up already. Let me see. I'll just go here. Let's I didn't say this video was going to be um, short. So what you do is you, you get them to the Facebook group, the customer group, since now that they join, and you invite them. But they won't be able to get into the customer group unless they're already in. So don't even worry about that. You invite them, you click invite, find their name. They should be your friend already. Find their name and invite them. And this is what they'll get. And of course, we got lots of information. Okay, so he just invited this guy. And this is what we do. We invite them, put a nice picture, put a word of encouragement, and people will go behind you and love them. And love them. They put all announcements, the lives. It's crazy in here. And everybody will start getting... See, that's why when I'm sitting here doing videos, people are getting people in. So we're letting you know this is, oh, this is my last guy. I put it, Reggie. And of course, that's me. Um, so, and then, you know, you go through a different, everybody is bringing, this is what I'm saying. It's not just one person bringing people in. See, all these names are different. Well, other than uh, Paul, but he followed, he put two people in a row, but, <laughs> but this is the group. You put, send them an invite. Um, it'll be sent to them, uh, the management will approve it, and then you'll go ahead and they'll go ahead and um, accept the invite. Also, they'll get this in their email. They get this in their email. That's what I'm saying. You got to employ your people to read their emails. They'll get this link in their email on the groups. They'll get this in the two telegram they post to join in their email. So tell them to go get their roadmap out their email to help them sign up too. So we got to get people to take responsibility for their own stuff because this is their business. Now we teach them and we teach them in a nice way, but we also got to teach them how to be responsible because other than that, they're going to be calling you every 20 seconds for stuff that they should be able to learn how to do. So if you teach them, then you tell them just to keep practicing. That's what Bruce Lee said. When you think you're a master, go back and practice. <laughs> so if Bruce Lee, who will beat like 20 people up at one time, say that, what you think we should be doing? You know what I'm saying? Doing exactly what Bruce Lee said. So you put them in a group. Um, sometimes they will already be in the results group, but if not, you do the same thing. You put them in the results group. So we got to make sure that they're in both groups because they can add their people to the results group. Anybody can go to the results group. It doesn't matter if they're in or not in, but they should, sometimes you can get them in a the results group. If you're just talking to them first and they didn't say yes the first time, you automatically put them in the results group. Automatically put them in the results group. So you add them to the, the Telegram group. Um, okay, yeah, still right here. Facebook groups, introduce them with a picture and encouragement like you just seen. Uh, results group, you just add them to the results group. That's just a group you can put your results. It's a whole lot of people in there that's not in the business that, you know, that's still anybody that they like anything you put up in there that you can recruit them as yours. So it's a beautiful group to be a part of. Um, or you can put your new people in a group so that you see what's going on. But everybody needs to be in a results group. Um, then you add them to the Telegram groups. Um, they will need you to friend you and send a hi because if they're not your friend on Telegram, you won't see them. You will not see them. So Manifest has these groups. Um, so the group that you can add them to is the mentorship group and the P2L marketing group. P2L paid to live marketing group. These are two you can add them to. Now the, the uh, corporate group and this group right here, they have to add themselves to it. So what they got to do is when you send them the link or when they get the email or you just send them a link that they can sign themselves up to these two groups. So two, you can put them in, well, three, you can put them in, you can put them in this group right here, pay to live. And you can put them in this group right here. And if they're a CEO, you can add them to the CEO group, but they got to be a CEO or come to the CEO group. If they're not CEO, they'll just get every, all the four, these four groups. And the CEO group, of course, once they upgrade, they can have it. So you put them in those groups. Two, you can put them in. Two, they put themselves in. And if they go to CEO, it'll be three, you put them in. And it's easy. So say if I wanted to come to, say, the mentorship. 
and I wanted to add somebody. All I'll do is come right here, click on this, click add members, find them, and then go ahead, go ahead and add them. I'm gonna come off of it pretty fast because you know people's names on there. But you find them and then you add them, and then they'll pop up at the bottom. Uh, you see, I have a real quick uh, people saying people either added people, like see Terrence Gibson added, and let me see Terrence Gibson added. I mean, you know, just adding people daily, and this was like the last few days, I believe. But anyway, you'll see different people adding different people just for you know that just Terrence Gibson ain't the only one. Uh, inviting people. Everybody's inviting people. Everybody's inviting people. So it is what it is. It is what it is and it's good. So you get them in the Telegram groups, um, add them to the Telegram groups. They may need to friend you and say hi. So if they're not your friend, they'll friend you. Send them your at whatever sign. Mine's is at TDG. I'm free. Um, then they'll, they'll send me a hi. That way I get them. Then you go to your contacts and you lock them in. You go to your contacts, you get the person's name, you go to contacts and you lock them and add them to your contacts. I would have to have a new person to do it. So I don't have anybody new, so I can't really show you it. But um, once they send you a hi, at the top of the screen is gonna say contacts. Add the contacts, you click that, you add them in and a, a, a box will pop up, you click save or whatever and then they're added and then you can go and start adding them to the groups. Um, so manifest mentorship, uh, P2L marketing, the ones I showed you, and then you they'll get the links in their email to these other two groups right here, corporate trading signals. They're going to get them. They're going to get them in the email. And the manifest times paid to live is this, the, the trading signals group. So it just changed the name, but it's the same link. Same link. So send them the link to these two groups. It's going to be in the email, but like I said, you got to get them to read the email. Then you add them to your team chat. So I have my own team chat. Um, let me go back to Facebook. Uh, that's the movers chat. So that's the chat with all the people who have um, recruited 10 or more people. And then I have my own Manifex FS bosses chat right here with, with my team in it. And we're, we're, we're pretty deep. We pretty pretty deep, man. We just post all post all the stuff that you need to know. Like this is the education schedule. Wow. Oh, well, for some reason lately, if you're not on the cell phone, I don't know. Pictures come up that small, but if I go on my cell phone, I'll be able to read it. But I should show in the education level. You can find that on any Zoom that we just posted or any of my videos um, that just goes over the overview. But you add your people, you get them plugged in. And to everything going, it's funny because I'm looking at this picture right here, and I guess because I'm logged in, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 10, 11, 12, 13. All these are my people. <laughs> Maybe because I'm I'm logged in and I'm looking at them, but all these are my people. Of course, I have more, but I just noticed I was like, hold on, these are all my people. But I mess with the way that Facebook is uh, set up. Facebook is pretty weird. Um, so let's go back to the sheet. I just want to make sure everything is there. We covered everything. Add them to the chat. Um, you already introduced them to the group. You're going to get a lot of love. And then I show you, the, I think I did. Did I show you the love? I know I showed you the picture. I'll show you all the love that they're getting. So obviously this picture was just posted and you already got 12. The ones that I just clicked on was just posted and you already got 21. So, I mean, just saying, you know, 27. <laughs> so it's just crazy. And it's good to tell your person to come on here and thank everybody for welcoming them. Because, you know, sooner or later, people get tired of welcoming you if you don't ever say thank you. So just quick, give them a quick thank you. Thank you for um, introducing, you know, uh, welcoming me. I'm ready to get this money. <laughs> I'm ready to change my life. I'm ready to hit my financial goals. Remember, you don't want to be financially free. That's not what we're trying to be. We're not trying to be financially free. Because remember, a person on the street and a person in the Hamptons are both financially free. This one got more money than they know what to do with. And this one has no money and no bills. And they're financially free because they don't, and nobody looking for them. You know what I'm saying? So you don't want to be financially free. You need to figure out your goals and meet the goal. You got to meet the financial goals that you're trying to achieve. All right. So I think without further ado, look at this one more time. And once again, it's your boy, Taryn Gibson. My videos are not scripted. 
I got this list for you to go over, for us to go over and go through it to keep me on point. But these are not scripted. So I am just real. I ain't gonna say as they come, but I'm pretty real. <laughs> I'm pretty real. And we just go through things and don't add nothing to it. Don't take nothing away from it. Learn that from preaching. Yeah, so we answered everything. The DTA form went over that. Once again, I'll show it to you again, and then we're going to go ahead and end this video. Um, let's see what's in the back. And I got to log back in. Click on student login when you're already in there. You log in. Um, go right here to my account, and there it goes. That's the form. That's the form that you're looking for. So for all your CEOs, they'll have it say CEO, and if they're not CEO, it'll say, um, it might just say DTA form. I'm not sure what it actually says uh, because the platinum and the, and the royalty can use the same form. So once again, it's your boy Terrence Gibson. Went over this list. I'm gonna leave it right here so you can pause it at the end to make sure you see everything you needed to see. Get your people signed up, get your people educated, send them the form, because I'm going to send out the form with the links in it to the people that are in, and you can send it to your new people so that they can have it to go through while you're going through it. It's best, train your people up, because like what was I saying, say, if you give a man a fish, he'll eat for a day, but if you teach him how to fish, he'll eat forever. This is what we're doing. We're teaching people how to fish so they can take care of their families forever. Amen. What's well, your boy Terrence Gibson saying? I love you once again. Hope you enjoyed this video. Watch it, share it, do whatever you got to do. Let's rise to the top. God bless.